What's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm going to show you guys on how to make this Tan Joggers Invisible Torso Outfit for your male character. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the Tan Joggers method. For the first part, I'm going to show you guys on how to get the Tan Joggers. To get the Tan Joggers, you will want to head over here to this location on the map, which is going to be at this clothing store next to this stunt race. Whenever you do get here at this location, you're now going to want to go ahead and make sure you have the stunt race ready. If you guys don't, just pull up your interaction menu, go to Map Blimp Options, go ahead and click on that, go to Jobs, and then go to Stunt Races. And if it is set to hide like this, you won't see it on the map. But if it is set to show, then you will see it on the map. So now that your job is set to show, back out of Hide Jobs and back out of Map Blimp Options and scroll up and register as a Sekiro Serve. After you have started an organization, you're now going to want to pull up your interaction menu up again. Go to Secure Serve CEO, go to Management, go to Style, and on your CEO Style, you're going to look for the Warlord Outfit. If you cannot find the Warlord Outfit through your CEO Style, then you that's because you don't own a CEO Office. So you need to own a CEO Office so you will get the Warlord Outfit. But whenever you are wearing this outfit, you can then just put away your interaction menu, walk into the blue circle, and you're just going to want to press right on the D-pad to enter. After you do enter the job, you don't need to change anything. You can then just confirm the settings whenever you are here and then just launch the job on you on your own. After you do launch the job on your own, you're just going to want to scroll through the motorcycles for at least a few seconds. It doesn't matter if they are yours or just stock motorcycles. Just scroll through the motorcycles for at least a few seconds and then you can just quit the job. Whenever you do quit the job, you will be wearing the outfit you had on before the Warlord. Now you're going to want to try to hurry as fast as you can, run inside the clothing store just like this, and go up here to the front counter, and you're going to sit here until it does kick you out. So maybe it could take up to 15 seconds or so, but eventually, whenever it will kick you out, you will see that you are wearing the Warlord outfit with the tan joggers just like this. Now, all you want to do is pull up your interaction menu, click on Secure Serve CEO, and hit Retire. Once you retire, you will see that you are wearing the outfit still, and it is not going to disappear. Now, I'm just going to show you guys on how to make the invisible torso tan joggers glitched outfit. So you should still be wearing the warlord outfit. Now for this, we're just going to want to go over here to the top section, scroll down until you do find work shirts, which will be on slot 38. And then you're going to click on work shirts and you're going to look for the brown cross open check on slot 57. Once you do equip this work shirt, you can then just back out. Go ahead and scroll up until you do find designer t-shirts which will be on slot 32 and you're going to look for the black print t-shirt on slot 59. After you do equip the black print t-shirt you can now just back out of the tops. We don't need to worry about the pants since we already do, do have the tan joggers. Go over here to your accessories, click on gloves which will be on slot 7 and equip the white cotton gloves on slot 53. After you do equip the white cotton gloves that will be all for your accessories. Now go over here to your shoes, click on sport shoes on slot 9 and equip the all white sports shoes on slot 28. Whenever you do equip the all white sports shoes you can then just back out and take off any head accessories that your character has. So this is what your outfit should look like so far. Whenever your outfit looks like this walk up here to the front counter hit edit saved outfits and you're going to want to save this outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save your outfit you're now going to want to back out of your edit saved outfits scroll down through the clothing until you find heist coveralls on slot 13 and scroll down from slot 9 through slot 12 and equip one of these outfits with the toxic mask. After you do equip one of these outfits, back out of the front counter and we're going to head over here to the pier to do the telescope glitch. When you do make it to a telescope on the pier, just do the telescope glitch. Go and run by the telescope like this, press right on the d-pad, you'll see that your character runs in place, then look short the telescope, that's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu, go to your style, go to your outfits and equip the tan joggers outfit that we just created at the clothing store, which should look like this. After you do equip this outfit, put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope and you will see that the mask merges over with the outfit, just like this. All we're going to do now is just head to a gun store. After you have made it to a gun store, go over here to the top section, hit edit saved outfits and save this outfit on any slot that you want. And whenever you do save the outfit, you're now going to want to go ahead and back out of your tops and we're going to start up a job, so hit pause. Go to online, click on jobs, click on play job, click on rockstar created, then click on missions, look for the job that's called a titan of a job, and fully start up that mission. Once you load to the job, you should see that your character has an invisible torso. You're now going to want to go over here to the top section, hit edit saved outfits, and save this outfit once again on any slot that you want. After you do save your outfit, you can then just back out of your tops, pull up your phone, and quit the job from your phone. 
whenever you do load back into a public or an invite only session, run back inside the gun store and you're going to want to equip an alpha that has a belt. So if you already have a saved alpha that has a paramedic belt or a comp belt, you guys can use that outfit. Or if you don't have any of those, you can go over here to the outfit section inside the gun store. Go over here to the Diamond Casino Heist on slot 51. Go to the Group A Sex Gear, which is on slot 20. And you can use one of these outfits with this type of belt. If you guys don't like these or if you don't have them unlocked, you can now go to Maintenance, which will be on slot 18. And you can use one of these outfits that has this type of belt if you don't like these or don't have them unlocked. Then you can go ahead and back out, go up to Prison Guards, which will be on slot 15, and use one of these outfits that has those type of belts. So you do need a belt for your for your invisible tor or for your torso to stay invisible. That's the only way you guys can have it stay invisible if you do put a belt on your outfit. So after you do choose an outfit that you want with the belt, I'm gonna go ahead and use the cop belt. So I'm gonna go ahead and equip this outfit that used to have checkerboard, but now Rockstar for Summers and blacklisted it. But all we're gonna do now is the merge glitch. So I will leave a link in the description for the, the it's a G thing. If you guys just wanna do that, just click on the link, bookmark it, and then you guys can do that job. But for me, I'm gonna do the heist apartment merge. So I will get back to you when I am at my apartment. When you do make it to your apartment, go into the heist planning boardroom and walk up here to the heist planning board. And out of all the five heists, you're gonna to wanna to start with the first one that's called the flake of job. After you start with the flake of job, the first job it's gonna be due, it's gonna be called scope out. Once you complete the scope out mission, the second job it's gonna be due, it's gonna be called Kruma. So when you have the Kruma job available, just launch that mission. Whenever you are in here, you're going to want to set your heist clothing to player saved outfits. After your heist clothing is set to player saved outfits, you can then confirm your settings and then invite whoever you want, like a random or a friend. And once someone does join, just launch the job. Now that you're here, just scroll to the slot to wherever you did save the outfit. So my outfit will look just like this. Once your outfit looks like this, then you can just hit ready to play. And whenever you are in the job, all you need to do now is just pull up your phone and just quit the job from your phone. So whenever you are back in a public or an invite only session, you're going to want to find a vehicle. It doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or a random civilian car on the street. But once you do find a car, you're now going to want to go and get inside that car, pull up your interaction menu and register as a secure serve or a motorcycle club. Once you've done this, pull up your interaction menu up again, click on secure serve CEO, go to management, or you can go to your motorcycle club and then go to management, go to style and on your CEO style or MC style, scroll one time to the left and then one time to the right back to none. Now hop out of the car and you will see that the belt that you wanted on your outfit merges and your invisible torso does not disappear. Now, all you wanna do is go to a clothing store. After you make it to a clothing store, go over here to the hat section, go to bulletproof helmets, which will be on slot 19, and you're gonna equip the tan bulletproof. Whenever you do equip the tan bulletproof helmet, that's pretty much it for the outfit. So if you guys wanna see what it looks like in the pause menu, here you guys go. Pretty clean tan joggers outfit. Now you can go over here to the front counter, Hit edit saved outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. Once you have saved it, that will be all. So I hope you guys did enjoy this glitched invisible torso tan joggers outfit for your male character. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.